The results are in this morning. We're taking a look at some of the key races from the Pennsylvania primaries. Well, the biggest of those results comes in the 10th congressional district in the Democratic primary, where former TV anchor Janelle Stelson defeated her five other opponents to become the nominee. Let's take a look at the numbers. With 98% of the precincts reporting, Stelson earned around 44% of the vote. Fox 43's James Gorgon is live in Derry Township, Dauphin County, where Stelson held her election party last night. And he explains what this race now is going to mean for November. Good morning, James. Good morning, Jackie. And what this means is that, is that the stage is now set for a showdown between Stelson and the six-term incumbent, Congressman Scott Perry, in November. Last night, Stelson was able to parlay her name recognition from an over 20-year career as a news anchor into that runaway primary victory. The question now is whether she can do the same in November to get to Washington and unseat a Republican incumbent in the process. Stelson won the primary last night by a little over 20 percentage points over her nearest opponent, former Marine Mike O'Brien. She celebrated her watch party last night right here at the Englewood in Derry Township, Dauphin County. Afterwards, Stelson said that she believes she is the right candidate to flip a district won, seven, won by seven points by Perry just two years ago. Josh Shapiro, our Democratic governor, won this district by 12 points against Doug Mastriano. And I think you can make the argument that Mastriano is nothing but Scott Perry light. So with the right candidate, I think we can really do this. Now we also cut up with Perry uh, yesterday, who has defeated all of his Democratic challengers since the congressional map was redrawn in 2018 to make the district a little more competitive. He ran unopposed on the Republican side in yesterday's primary. If you want to continue with not being able to afford your gas prices, your grocery bills, your credit card bills, being concerned about your financial future, then you're going to have a choice to make about that. Perry also said yesterday that regardless of who won the primary, they'd be running as, quote, Joe Biden's running mate and referred to their agenda as, quote, radical. Now, the general election campaign begins now, and it will kick off tomorrow right here on the Fox 43 Morning News, where you will see my conversation, my full conversation yesterday with Congressman Perry, where we discuss the issues such as the economy, abortion, the southern border, and the... <laughs> But foreign aid, my goodness, it's been a long couple of days with the primary. But you could catch that tomorrow on Fox 43, on the Fox 43 Morning News. But for now, we're live in Derry Township, Dauphin County. I'm James Cargan with Fox 43 News. All right, and thanks, James.